Welcome back everyone, it's Rainy from Rainy Rocks. In today's video I'm going to show you what I do with uh, these crystal clusters that I make with um, leftover resin from various projects. I found these great containers with bamboo lids so I've gone ahead and taped the backs um, and I've painted them with the folk art uh, antique white. So like I said, we're using Folk Art Antique White, Conch Shell by Folk Art. Oh, this, I don't remember what that one is. All the products that I'm using will be listed in the description box. Uh, I used Ice Blue by Deco Art, um, Diamond Dust. I have some chunky gold glitter that I found. At our at my local restore in the craft section and casting craft some icicle by eye candy and Aga's art studio gold so I'm just gonna go ahead and just do a puddle pour on these
face. Look at that. I've already gone ahead and taken the tape off the back. I've left one here and I'm going to show you how I do how I do it. But uh, yeah, just a little bit of sanding there. But look at that. Oh, and then one thing I forgot to do actually when I was just creating a huge a huge mess, I forgot to use the gold glitter. So off camera like quickly as fast as I could before everything started curing because that's pretty much what happened. Um, I just placed some gold. I, for this one I just put some a little bit here and there. Um, and this one I just placed it in and around the um, uh, the cluster. But uh, look at this one. I just It's so beautiful. And there's the back. See, originally these guys, you would, uh, you know, they had a hole in it and then it had like a, uh, a little leather strap and you could lift it up. But because of, I've used the cluster mold, uh, crystal, I mean, um, they can just pick it up like this. But yeah, I love it. I love them. I'm in love with these guys. And then here's the pink one pink and white. Isn't that pretty? Look at the, uh, I don't know if you guys can see that. I actually took some of the drips and I laid them on over the area that didn't have much resin on it because of the fact that it was tilting. Um, but so when I did that, it's created these, um, it's created this effect. I love it. It's so beautiful. Yeah, so here we go. Here's the blue one. I am in love with this one. And I think I'm going to make coasters, a tray and coaster set with this blue in the gold. Because, uh, yeah, I just want to see it in action when it has some different effects. But uh, this is beautiful. Okay, so I have, so I have the tape. And this is, and it comes off quick and easy here. So what I do is, careful not to burn yourself, I just heat up the sides quickly. I don't need a lot. There we go. Should be enough. Let's actually rip this. Start it, and I haven't had oops, any seepage, which is good. I actually like this tape. It's uh, it's a tape that I get at Dollar Tree, or not Dollar Tree, sorry, Dollarama. I don't know if you guys in the states have Dollarama, but it's this one. Let me bring it up for you. It's called. Duramax. I've had, uh, I, I've used the other, which this one, I hate this one, the uh, Scotch brand. My husband bought that for me. Never again will I use it because I had actually used this to tape up some boards and it left tape, uh, ad uh, adhesive residue all over my boards. So I had to sand them all. Never. Well, I use that again. So yeah, Duramax. But see, it came out nice and clean. And here it is, folks. They're beautiful. All right, so here are the containers. They're a bit dusty. But here they are. Put that one there. one and this one and whoever buys these can use them for whatever they want I know
Thank you.